Today I'm going to start a new project. It's going to be a cotton mouth snake and I want to try to carve it out of the single piece of tupelo wood. I'm anxious to get started so I hope you stay tuned. Before I start carving, I need to do a lot of studying. The first thing I like to do is sculpt the little clay model to help me visualize the shape I want. We don't have any cotton mouths in our area, so my friend Edward Mercer was kind enough to send me some videos and pictures. The cotton mouth, or water moccasin, lives in the swamplands of the southeastern U.S. It's a poisonous viper and spends most of its time in or around water. As I'm carving, I realize it's going to be a real challenge to wood burn the scales and the tight curves of the snake's body. As the nights get colder, I like to make sure the little birds have plenty of food to eat. They need to fatten up for the winter. While I'm enjoying the chickadees, 
Pearl keeps a keen eye out for jaybirds and squirrels. She doesn't get along with them very well. I need to make a few special wood burning tips for this project. as far as I can with the regular scale tips and it's finally time to deal with those hard to reach areas. Here's what I came up with to get the job done. Thank you. 